Pip had quite an interesting character development where he did not go from strength to strength, nor from weakness to weakness, but he endured periods of peaks and troughs. When things were good, they were really good, and when things were bad, it might as well have been the end of the world for him. I liked him, I disliked him, I was ashamed of him, and I felt sorry for him. Even after reading the novel, I can't quite pinpoint how I feel about Pip, because although he messed up, he just wanted a better life for himself. Despite his many flaws and well-deserved ending, you can't help but feel bad for the sad life he set himself up for. Dickens does a great job of evoking so many feelings and emotions towards Pip, which maintained my interest in his story and character.